This is all what equality is about. You know, back in the days, it was the men that were just feeling like this. Having to wake up every day, go in a minefields for their entire life. It was just us, but now, <laughs> now you join us in the suffering. And it's lovely to have you. Feminism, equality, such a beautiful thing, people. Such a beautiful thing. I don't want to do anything to make money. I don't want to. I just find it so terrible that at the young age of 23, I'm ready to check out. Like, I don't want to do anything at all. I don't want to work because my money's not mine. I don't want to go to school because I feel like I'm getting a degree for somebody else. Like, I don't want to do anything. And I feel like that's so sad. I'm having my regular meltdown and realizing I'm never going to escape capitalism. And I'm just to be a cog in the machine of productivity for my whole life so you know that numb feeling that you have now like that sense of ambivalence like you're kind of just going through the motions in the world and pretending like ever this is just life I, I was at work today and i said i can't believe that our parents and our grandparents and everybody else before them day worked and go to every work every day of their fucking life for the rest of our the lives same fucking monotonous Five boring ass shit 40 plus hours a week weeks of just vacation. to retire at the ripe age of what 60 65 70 where they literally can't enjoy the money that they have made push to their limits like people are exhausted if you work a regular job even if you don't work a regular job the constant stress i'm having to worry about how to make ends meet you see these people they don't want to work and i get it working sometimes it can be monotonous many people don't like their job but the solution can't be to not do anything the solution can't be to cry for socialism because socialism thankfully isn't gonna happen the only solution is to grind now and relax later. You see, for a lot of women, they they can. They can be stay-at-home mothers. They can find a good man to take care of them, but they don't want to do that because they'll be giving up too much of their rights. They're feminists. They're strong women. Continue to be strong. Put in those hours, 40, 50 hours a week. Tell you go and work. The moment you don't work, these men are going to eat you as if they're eating ice cream and the kajo has sugar cane. Unless you begin to work, the moment you start working, this place is gonna settle. Mm. Um, it's just a, a cooler device to my women. Like the moment you don't want to work, this place will be worked up so bad. Mm gonna meet all kinds of bad people in this world so when you start working like life is gonna be easy remember women working is gonna make life easy so i feel like now that women have proven that we can work and be just as successful as men i think we should go back to where women don't have to work because i don't want to nah we need those four yells this might be a little too real, but how do I tell my mother that even though I'm 20 years old, I've been working since I was 14, and I know I had to work. I've always had to work for the things that I want. I never got anything handed to me, but I'm 20 years old. I don't want to work anymore. I don't want to do this shit. I'm putting deodorant on because I'm sweating because I just walked up the stairs because I don't be doing any type of physical exercise. So, like, I've just been laying in my house for like a week. I got fired from my job because I don't want to go. I don't want to show up. I'm yelling in, in silence because I can't yell. Because if I yell in my house, I get my ass break. So that's why I can't tell my mama that I don't want to work. Because you got to. You got to get up and go to work, girl. You're 20 years old. You got to go to work. You got to go to school. You got to do everything. I don't want to do that anymore. I don't want to do that anymore. And everybody I tell, they're like, just go apply for more. Shut up. I don't want to work anymore. This is all what equality is about. You know, back in the days, it was the men that were just feeling like this. Having to wake up every day, go in a minefields for their entire life. It was just us. But now, <laughs> now you join us in the suffering. And it's lovely to have you. I don't want to go to work because it makes me really sad. And I got to deal with people and I don't want to do that. I am broke even though I work 40 hours a week. It's okay. I'm fine. Get me! You see that? Fellas, you see that? Man, go check out that whole video. She talking about how she don't want to work and she want a man to take care of her. 
Boy, you see her? You see how she look? You know how many men tried to take try to take care of her when she was coming up? You know how many men she was like, boy, I, I got my own money. They always get tired. You understand? They always get tired. You understand? They always get tired. Do you understand, bro? I understand. I understand. I, I understand. Especially the baddies. Sooner or later, bro, that's the ones. Oh, I just want a man to leave me. But when they young, got all that attention, oh, they feel like they're on top of the world, bro. But it's going it's gonna to happen. Oh, they're going to slow down. That's what we call hitting the wall. Lifestyle than what I can support on but my own. But the thing own. is, what you And do it on your own, on your own salary. It's a piece of paper. It's bragging rights. <laughs> it's not rights. a piece of paper. It's bragging rights at the end of the day. I mean, How many women have degrees and don't want to work? Right. That's the that's first thing you have so I remember when I was a bit younger, I kept saying, oh, I want to be independent. I want to be able to work, you know, earn my own money, be my own person. I still want all those things. But one day if I meet a Mecca, and the Mecca has some fine girl, stay at home. Can I have a salary? Can I have a salary? Can I have a salary? Can I have a Forget it. Because these streets are not funny. Look at that side. And I was supposed to go outside and be walking and be doing independent woman. And they reconsider all those independence now. Feminism has tricked these women into believing that their work will fulfill them. And we trying to tell them that it's not in the long term. Your family is what's going to fulfill you. But that's misogyny. We're going back in time. We don't want to go back in time. We need to be progressive. So work. I don't even bash these women anymore. Because I see so many, even in my own family, Women tired of working. It's unfortunate. But we need those four hours. They look very good on the GDP. So I'm going to need you to clock in Monday morning bright and early. We need those hours. I'm going to need those hours. <laughs>